Welcome to AFAX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Now, as you all know, yesterday Lili Nganga was trending. And basically, why she was trending is that netizens felt that she had downgraded when she married rapper Giuliani. Now, this came about because Dr. Alfred Mutua had traveled to the United States for the United Nations General Assembly. And people started making comparison that Lili Nganga is back in Kenya changing diapers while she would be the wife to the CES. Basically, tagging her for not choosing material over her peace of mind and perhaps a better life that they assume she doesn't have right now since she's not with Dr. Alfred Mutua. That being said, there are those who are propagating some rumors. We can call them rumors. And I'll just read this statement. Bonface Mongi has allegedly testified in court today in a suit filed by Lilian Nganga over properties she jointly owns with Alfred Mutua. Bonface Mwangi says Mutua has bankrupted Lilian and is therefore appealing to the court to compel him, Mutua, to offer financial support to the child she nganga bo with Giuliani. And of course, sadly, people will believe what they have already seen. And this even made Bonface Mwangi trend as well. And there were memes about him, which will, I'll just show you guys one. And there was no report, official report made either by Bonface Mwangi or the mainstream media of these allegations that were put out there that he took the stand and testified in court. He even dismissed this as bogus rumors from bloggers. And so like I mentioned earlier, the comparison was there. You can see on the left, Dr. Alfred Mutua, who had just landed in the United States of America, attending the United Nations General Assembly. And on the right, you see Giuliani enjoying fatherhood with his son. And he was out for a stroll. You can see him with a stroller. And these were the comparisons of two different men that Lilian Nganga has been with. And right now, she's forced to be here in Kenya. So as you can see, what I'd mentioned as well about Bonfest Mwangi. This is uh, this is a meme that had been shared. Bonfest Mwangi explaining to the court why Alfred Mutua should pay child support to Giuliani's kid after Lillian goes bankrupt. So basically, what people are putting it out there is Giuliani is not able to provide for his family, take care of his wife and his child because Lillian Nganga had gone bankrupt. Basically, propagating that Lillian Nganga is the one who has been providing in this relationship. So if you missed yesterday's video video and that conversation and what people are saying check out yesterday's video but these were just some of the things that people are saying as you can see this is a meme of a woman cooking the husband is right there and uh, they shared Lillian and Giuliani somewhere in Nairobi West while Alfred Mutua is enjoying himself in the United States of America. And of course, word reached Lillian Nganga as to what people are saying and why she's trending and she decided to respond to that by taking to her Insta stories where she put out this statement saying, just seen some shallow story that you're all trying to drag me into. Kweli Hamchoki and Eleni too. Let me proceed with my day with my little boy. And so one man being put out as the ultimate man for Lilian Nganga and the other who is being seen as somebody who is not able to provide for his family is Giuliani. Now, he did put a tweet asking Kenyans for help for donations so that he can be able to buy diapers. And of course, anyone who read that could see that that was put out sarcastically. And actually, there are Kenyans who sent money. There are people who are responding to that tweet showing that they have sent a thousand shillings, 50 Bob, whatever. And this is the tweet. And so Giuliani shares this particular photo. Back in the days, we can see him here. He has no dreadlocks. Probably this is a photo taken in Dandora where he grew up. And because people were referencing Dandora yesterday, quite a lot saying that Lilian Nganga would have been in the United States with Dr. Alfred Mutua, but she left him for a man who comes from Dandora. So maybe that's why he put this particular photo with this significant meaning instead of a photo of him in the present day and he shared wase nikubaya niko broke mtoi anahitaji pampas please send mpesa and you can see the business number account is juliani chochote unaweza itasaidia you are truly struggling rapper slash entrepreneur and so there were kenyans who took this message as a real confirmation that Giuliani has gone broke. And there are those who are criticizing him, calling him out, calling him names, letting him know that
that he needs to go out there and work hard to provide for his family. Usikuje kutuomba pesa hapa. And Julian ended up responding and putting another tweet out there about an hour later that people should not always believe what they read online. And he tweeted, please treat this message with contempt like the rest that keeps coming your way. Never believe what's online. So there are some people who felt some type of way. They felt that Julian should have just ignored what was happening out there. He should not have put out this message that he stooped low asking Kenyans for money even though he was doing it sarcastically. So maybe we can just say that celebrities are human beings. They get hurt. And Giuliani, who saw what was being peddled around yesterday online, decided to give his haters or people who are peddling these stories that he's not able to provide for his family, giving them what they want, and that is him borrowing money to support his family. Anyway, that's what's happening. Thank you so much for watching. You're up to date. Please subscribe and also turn on your post notifications so you're notified once new uploads are up and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.